do you think that faith is, is a good thing? Um, that having faith is, is a positive attribute. Well, first of all, let's define what faith is. Faith is trust. Okay. The opposite of faith is, is not reason, and the opposite of reason is not faith. The opposite of reason is irrationality. The opposite of faith is to distrust. So everybody trusts in something. The only question is, do you have evidence to trust in it? And there are some things you can't get evidence for, like reason itself. Why? Because any defense of reason by reason would be circular. We all have faith that reason works. Okay. Why do you think God instituted faith? Like, why not just appear to everybody on their 12th birthday and be like, hey, by the way, I'm real, and then do a backflip and skate away? What's the... Because I don't think our biggest problem is God showing up to everyone. In fact, if you look at some of the more vociferous atheists, people like Peter Atkins, Peter Atkins was asked recently, what would convince him that God existed? And he said, in fact, one guy said, if Jesus were to appear to you, what would you do? He'd say, I'd go see my psychiatrist. <laughs> There's nothing that would convince me that God exists. God gives us enough evidence to know that he exists, but he doesn't give us so much that we don't have the free will to turn away and go our own direction. He gives us that freedom. If he were like a stalker around us at all times, hey, here I am again, hey, here I am again, would that in any way do you think encourage a love relationship or would you just be annoyed with him if you didn't want to follow him you'd be annoyed God isn't interested in us intellectually believing he exists God is interested in us having a love relationship with him where we trust in him and for that he's got to keep some distance if he's stalking us all the time that would be annoying so he gives us enough to know but also enough freedom to go our own way does that make sense yeah, yeah, that uh, was explained very well. All right, thank you, Caleb. Mm -hmm.